working. Alright, there we go. I'm not getting my uh, milking on it, which is kind of weird. I, I think you guys can hear me, right? Indeed. Okay. We're just playing a regular playthrough on New Game Plus. We are starting with a, uh... Starting on 1-1. One, one. Pretty simple. We're gonna be playing through the game, probably make it halfway, considering my inventory. You guys, I hope you guys enjoy it. If you hear, go ahead and speak up in chat, and I'll gladly listen. Respond to you and everything. That's where Irving will be. Alpha team is already I will be skipping cutscenes as it's already plainly obvious. <sighs> Beginning part is very simple, just running through a few spots. I am using the SIG P20, P226 They probably won't drop anything anyway Miss the time when crows are actually useful That's always a herb right there, so useful to uh, Thanks, get it. Give me the shovel for now. I'll be getting a red herb pretty soon. Unlike my uh, handgun playthrough, I would likely be killing everything. <laughs> If you were so good to play this, I've been playing uh, Resident Evil 4 in my off time, and admittedly I just tried to turn around without using the uh, right analog stick. Yeah, Wizard of War is pretty fun, but my god, tank control suck. Uh, I don't know what Sheva's doing, but she is not helping me. Wow. Three consecutive misses. Kinda switch guns. <laughs> it's like you hit anything. Yeah, I'd be much more likely to play version of four if it didn't have tank controls. Like, if they could just fix that. Like, that, it would be so nice if they fixed that. These 
these guys have grenades? I don't remember that. I do not recall these guys ever having grenades. Was it was that always a thing? Come in, Kirk. The locals were hostile and we had to use force. I do not remember that. We don't have that. any contingency like, plans for what? this situation, do we, Kirk? Roger on the locals, but your orders still stand. What does that mean? Seems like I might be using that a little bit sooner than I thought. Jeez. Come on! Hurry! Roger! Seriously, I do not recall those enemies ever having dynamite. I thought dynamite was only a thing in later levels. I know they appear in, uh, Chapter 2 and everything past that. Hurry! Roger! I frankly did not know that. That's actually pretty interesting. I mean, I don't fight these guys too often, but... You okay. grab it. Yeah, please don't use that. She's going to. Much appreciated. Well... I'm gonna close this. I shot that one because enemies can go through there, so... Although, honestly, I don't usually do that. Usually I just jump through there. But, it's actually pretty smart to do it like that. I'm actually pretty interested in finding something out. I want to know if he can take down the executioner before he whips this open. Frankly speaking, never tried doing it. So I'm gonna try doing that right now. Not that he's in. Could be alive. I'm gonna go with Magnum right here to do it. Come in. So. The locals are hostile. The gate is sealed, and we're trapped. We need backup, and we need it right now. Roger that. Just sit tight. I'm on my way. Did you hear that, Sheva? Help's on the way. Got it. Just hope he gets here quick. I just want to know if it's possible. I don't actually know who he appears. So. It is not- it seems like he's invulnerable right actually. I can stun him, but... Okay, Sheva. <laughs> I'm so, I'm doing terrible now because I tried to save Sheva. That's really unfortunate. So is... What are you doing, sir? Huh, I wonder if I just didn't hit him enough or something.
Frankly, I'm not sure. All I know is that I'm now super low on health as I boat myself. <laughs> Frankly, cannot survive any sort of hit. I can't believe I was missing stuff. I guess I'm aiming kind of. Oh, I'm aiming though, that's what's going on. There's just no end. We've gotta hold down till Kirk gets here. I don't think there's anyone in chat right now. Who is not? In any case, I was gonna ask what you guys' uh, favorite guns are in this game. Frankly speaking, I quite like, uh... I quite like a jailbreaker, actually. Jailbreaker's a very fun weapon, in my opinion. I also like this uh, scorpion that's actually called like the VZ61. I don't like that. VZ61. I'm just gonna call it the uh, TMP because that's exactly what it is. It's an insanely good weapon for uh, stunning enemies. Okay, I missed two shots just to get a headshot right there. Oh, he's still dead one shot. We'll send him with the team, uh, TMP a little bit. His enemies are getting weaker <laughs> before they could take at least one hit. Yeah, I'm quite used to tank controls right now, so if I try like strafe, if I strafe, I'm probably trying to turn around. I can't quick turn either and it's bothering me. <laughs> I just tried to uh, turn to the right really quickly by just aiming. There's no fool, that's a possibility because uh, you turn around using your le left analog stick, which is your movement one. <clears throat> I suppose I did so good on that uh, accuracy. Didn't expect that, honestly. You will see me upgrading stuff. I'm. Upgrade that, but okay. I'll be upgrading a few things on my uh, pretty much whenever I have the money to do so. On to one, two. We owe you one. Thanks for the help. This is not a very hard one. I'm going on it's kind of long though. Good luck. Probably the longest of the uh, first three missions. Is there one three in this game? I feel like there is. Hurry! No, it's. Maybe... Yeah, there's only three missions. I mean, there is three missions in, uh, Chapter 1. I couldn't recall if there was two or three. Okay, 
Okay, there's an herb somewhere in here. Is it this? I swear there was an herb right there. I'm, it might just be me thinking of a... Uh, chapter... One, uh, chapter 1-1. One, one. Oh, he was immune right there. He just took three shots in a fully upgraded, uh, pistol. I'll go ahead and get Sheva a shotgun. Should be one guy left. Guess not. Alright. Okay. Forgot about that guy. I actually jumped a little bit. <laughs> I use my shotgun a little bit during this uh, mission because there's just so many enemies that just pop right up in your face. I don't know what Chip is doing. She's like messing around with that box. Mm, shotgun shows. Yeah, they always let you know when you're in a shotgun in this game because they always give you ammo for it before you actually get the shotgun. Mission is done. You grab it. Roger. Yeah, and if I had to pick a machine gun, this is probably one of my favorites. Excluding the Heckler. Or whatever this game calls it. It's the one it's the one with the uh, piercing two, I believe. I missed it. There's a gem up here. So I'm gonna grab that. I guess I thought that was a gem. I don't think I was wrong. Really? <laughs> what are you doing? Uh, let's see. Let's... Yeah, I'll use the pistol. Okay. Ah, oh, I knew he was there. He was about to shoot, too. I thought there was an enemy behind me. I'm getting really l lucky with seeing these guys. Cannot see my red dot.
don't know, it's just fun using machine guns in this game because. Hurry! I mean, compared to the previous game, I think Resident Evil 4 only had like uh two machine guns. Correct me if I'm wrong, but I think it only had two. And one of them was the TMP, which was honestly m probably my favorite gun in that game. Random dead body that's somehow walking. I will go ahead and collect, uh, the emblems. That way anyone watching can also just know where they are if they don't have them yet. Get an achievement for collecting all 30 of them. I may not recall what all of them are, but... I definitely know what most of them are. Played this game probably a total of, uh, 20 times, beginning to end, honestly. If not 20, close to 15, but... Definitely played it more than a dozen. I don't know everything about the game because, uh, haven't actually played it that much in like a year, in like two years, honestly. I hope killing this guy with, uh, guns. Not rocket launcher, just guns. Knock this over, just for some extra damage. That's a little bit annoying. Killed him for a second. I get, I'm getting more damage from this actually. Because we don't know the striker does not actually do that much damage. Yeah, I didn't even have time to react to it though. If he just attacked. Oh, he can disappear. Wait. I actually did not know he could do that in this. Man, he's going pretty fast. <laughs> Can I want to go to inside the uh the bin? I wonder if the item can still spawn inside. Yeah, I can. Cool. Gotta wonder how HQ, I mean, how Alpha Team got destroyed like they did. Considering, like, that thing was not difficult. <laughs> also, you can literally just use that incinerator to destroy it, like... 
It's not that hard, honestly. I'm giving this for, this for a different playthrough. It's only 15 bullets, but you know. Not that you even need any bullets during that fight. I'm surprised they even give you any. But that's actually like the, one of the only places where they just give you free bullets. That. So, after that Oboro fight, uh, before Spider Boss, I don't actually know what that giant spider guy is called. Uh, let's see. I don't know what, where she got handgun ammo from, but. <laughs> I suppose I could upgrade this, but like. I don't know. I don't really care about the critical percent on this, honestly. I just want the firepower up. <laughs> I'll only be using this on a... Whenever if an ammo, anyway. That's my dog, if you didn't hear him, but, yeah. What am I doing? Oh, I'm trying to look for this. Got that fully upgraded. So I got the ammo to do them. Need 10,000 for that, and then I believe I have everything fully upgraded. Yeah, a little how the regular. She's pretty good at getting headshots, so. We can't let Irving get away. We have to get to the station. For those that don't know, this is right here, but that's probably the easiest one. I missed a uh, emblem in the previous mission. There's only two, I believe. But right where you got that handgun ammo, you can look through the little like chain links, and there'll be an emblem right there. It's kind of hard to shoot with the with a gun if you're not if you can't you can't really see the uh, thing very well. I used to think there's an emblem over here, but there actually isn't. I don't actually know all the ones in this one is to be fair. Whoops. Shot everything but in my third. And Shiva's doing work on the guy up there. No idea if she actually killed him or not, but. I don't actually know why I shot that. She did not kill him. Might as well get the jailbreaker out, because if you don't know. Next part is dogs. Life pretty strong. I actually just like the uh, jailbreaker because good range and is the fastest shooter. Plus, I feel like the hip shot is better. It it probably isn't, but. For a shotgun, I don't aim for the head. I always just aim for the uh, the gut anyway. So when you have that hip shot, I just always automatically get that hit that hit. I don't even have to worry about aiming that much. However, with like the Ithaka, which that's pretty much how you should pronounce that. Ah! <laughs> you guys didn't see that. Ow. Oh, 
Okay, for some reason, you would red dot actually aims at the uh, at the fence. Normally, you don't really get anything when you aim at something. You don't get that like circular dot, you know. Yet, if you aim at the fence, you actually get that weird dot. That is kind of weird. I wonder if that's because it's interactable. Never really thought about that before. Pretty sure that's always money and a verb, but I could be wrong. I think there's only two emblems in this one. Yeah, go ahead and stick with this. There's actually an achievement for killing the guy in the truck. But... It's really hard to aim from this far away. <laughs> I think Shiba actually hit that one guy. See, I'll probably only be breaking boxes that I know actually grant me something. Emily Mayhew. This is a dog filled tunnel with three rounds. I oh, just two rounds. Right. Pretty sure this is always money. So, Come on. getting stuck on Shepa. <laughs> I'm pretty sure like one of those is guaranteed to drop handgun ammo, and the other one is guaranteed to drop money. Could be wrong, but I'm pretty sure that's how that works. Something's coming. Watch out! Yeah, I think it's just when you have an interactable, it also... It's that weird image. This is actually the longest of a... The longest in uh, chapter one. Chapter six is probably the eh, maybe the longest one. Someone chapter three is also pretty long. That's merely because you deal with uh, deal with three one, which you have to do like three things, and it's just long for no reason. There's a gem in here, but I'm actually just trying to kill this guy because. It'd be annoying, but there's a gem all the way in this back corner. There's also the last BSA emblem right in here. It is kind of hard to shoot, but any sort of explosive will immediately get it. Whoops, that's not what I wanted. Thanks, partner. I actually want the, uh, hand grenade that's somewhere. Thanks, partner. 
She should automatically turn that eventually, but she might not. Is the hand, gun a hand grenade? Yes, it is. You can uh, throw a hand grenade right inside here, blow up the sides. Rock launcher will also work, but you get a Marcus Chan for your cause. Yep, she did do it. I think it's whenever she uh, grabs something. That she does that. Knifing is always faster than kicking, I think. Whoever. Ah, yes, I got past him. I like just running all the way over here because it's always safer to have like a linear line of enemies than it is to be surrounded. Whoever I like standing right here at the side. So yeah, if if you guys know this game, Striker is actually like the worst damage dealing gun. Well for shotguns at least. Oops. Run back through here. There's gonna be enemies soon on the other side. So, Sheva's gonna have to deal with that. Correction, I didn't actually go far enough to spawn them. There might be a gem over here somewhere, but I never actually check. Oh yeah, as soon as that cutscene plays, more enemies will spawn. But I think I broke the spawn because I got here quicker than wow. usual. I didn't think HQ actually cared. I don't think he actually killed anyone, dude. Well, that time he did. Because, yeah, normally there's actually two of those uh, big guys over here. There was another emblem right up here. There's also an herb, the green one. As you can see right there. There's another green herb down there if you guys saw. Trevor, why do you keep on doing that? <laughs> and then immediately put it back up. Yeah, I actually broke the spawns. So. Again, I don't think you killed anyone. I think it's Kirk that's up there. Good old sniper right here, but I'm not gonna grab it. I just got stuck right there. It does take two shots for the jailbreaker to kill one of these guys. So yes, it uh Thanks, partner. Sheva, why are you grabbing so much ammo? I can't I can't request it. Actually, I'll let him keep that. I, need ammo. I want to... Thanks for the help. I want to discard this, because... I do want some handgun ammo, because I am trying to do a handgun-only challenge, and I want to see if it's actually possible to get past 6-1. I have yet to be able to actually do it, but I haven't had an, I haven't had an inventory full of ammo yet, so... And I really don't care about getting ammo from different playthroughs, because... Handgun ammo comes from everywhere. Matter of fact... 1-3, you can just get pretty much infinite of it. Also, shotgun board, or shotgun shells does not go through uh, glass windows, apparently. Ran right past Sheva. That's why I missed. Thought she, I thought he was going to go full Sheva and then didn't.
Shiva isn't good old sniper, so she can handle that. Oh, so those enemies come out earlier, on? and only one of them can actually hit Sheva. So it's it's pretty useful to do that. Do be careful when you shoot enemies in their head and it explodes, because sometimes they can actually live without their head. And, well I say live, but they can actually like make one attack while they have no head. So you have to be kind of careful. There you go. He's dead. I owe you one. Give me an herb. Use Come this. on. You can't be serious. Give me a grenade. Use this. I want those, and I'm going to Thanks, give Shepard this. I actually got tricked by this, by an enemy like that, and uh... I was doing a fool. I was just gonna quit and save, and it was just like, eh, whatever. I like how that you can actually just see this guy, he won't actually do anything, unless you get right here. This is his trigger, he's got moving to the right of the sandbag. Yet, these guys in instantly can start coming down the stairs. Well. Yeah, as you guys can see, uh... This, uh... The Jailbreaker is really not a... Good gun for killing enemies. That might have done it. You can cheese this area by breaking the lock early. I'm just gonna use this to restore her. Did I already grab that grenade? Guess I did. Go downstairs to see if I actually did it. It's really easy to do. Like, it takes like no effort than other than a grenade. Didn't get it that time. It's kind of a weird throw you have to do, but it's like right on that blue banister. Oops, I went too far. You want to be on the second level to do it though. Yeah, if you can't hear the explosion, that means you got it. That's just how you know. I need ammo. Again, she is sniping ammo. Roger. Also, if you try to hit say thank you too soon, you can't do it. But yeah, it, it despawn- oh. Interesting. Alright, well I guess I'll just do it no more way, because obviously it doesn't want me to. But if you don't hear the explosion, there's a high likelihood that you did, you've done it. But, you know, other times it decides not to work. And quite honestly, I don't feel like wasting another one. So, oh, ha let him go. Whoops. Hit Trevor. Normally I carry a sniper on me, but I didn't this time. Shiva is getting smacked. I can't really do anything about it, because <laughs> she's at a spot where I couldn't see her.
Well, there's a boss right here, so I'm gonna use the magnum. There's two enemies. There they are. Jesus. Wait. That's kinda weird. Kinda sucks that I can't grab that. I can totally grab that. Chris, you have your buff arms, come on. Anyway, here comes the hardest part. By the way, this is probably the strongest magnum in the game. For balancing, that is. And this guy's still alive. Look at a single hit, though. They don't actually have as much health when you, uh, when they come back up. Yeah, if you want a magnum for pure balancing stuff, and this is probably the strongest magnum. Wait, but if you want the one that does the most damage per shot, which is good when you when you don't have infinite ammo, that would be the S and W magnum, which is the one you unlock from fully upgrading the one I have in my hand. I do not think there's an emblem yet, but there is next mission. There is an emblem on top of that radio tower. So, yeah. Yeah, this is a green herb. We have so many herbs. Unfortunately, you don't get that many red herbs in this game. Oh, so you can still shoot those guys. I don't think they can drop anything on that side. But yeah, you can still shoot them. It's kind of weird. You could, you could also shoot the ones above here and actually get stuff from it. Woo, quick time events. Probably one of the hottest quick time events in the game, honestly. Besides the fight before the last rest of the rest of But I usually. Well, I mean, it's probably the third hottest. Just because it's consecutive, and that last one usually gets people. Because if you're on veteran or higher. It could be X and A. But you know, I I've never had trouble with it, honestly. Let's see, this is probably the one of the longest missions in the game I hear. Two one is really long. I also don't like it that much. But if you have literally any sort of amount of flash grenades with you, it's super easy. Oh, the HK MP5, that's what it was. Uh, also, like on the wiki, for some reason it's referred to as the Heckler. Heckler Coat. Coach. Koch. Koch. I don't know how you pronounce it, but. Yeah, it's, it's said that way in the wiki for some reason. Other than that, though, uh, I might have enough ammo, I mean, money to fully upgrade the AK. I do. Alright, now I have literally every gun up fully upgraded, I'm pretty sure. Yep, there's the achievement. You guys probably can't see it because I'm not using a, uh, not using the actual, uh, capture card for this. I'm just using Twitch on the Xbox, the Twitch app, so... She's not actually using this at all, so. <laughs> Wasting space. She only ever uses two guns. It's always these two. At least that's how it is for me. I will be taking a sniper this time. Merely because this next area has some putts where you're gonna want some long range weaponry. 
Immediately after Shut the, uh, you know caves. The the Not too far from here. Or the mines, as they say it. Get this hand grenade right there if you guys want it. Also... Right over there. I like just running into those, I forgot about that one, so, if you run up here, the dogs can't get to you, or so I thought. I think there's one up there. Yeah. Oh, I can't see that one. Yeah, one of these guys always turns into it. Dog's cook. My dog is going crazy again. Anyway, there's. That guy, I'm gonna run until he shoots. I don't know if he died, so I just shot that. My grandfather probably just came over, so. Now, I need this because if I decide to uh, miss one of these mines, I'm definitely dying. You can shoot one. Somewhere. There it is. Shiva won't grab that item right there, which she really should. Her AI will just break boxes while you're next to a door, but... She won't grab the stuff when it actually matters. <laughs> Speed running, I wouldn't grab that, but you know. Also, if I was speed running, I'd totally only use a magnum, and maybe like a shotgun, just just for uh, some take it. ease. I'll take the I'm gonna use the magnum because I don't like this area. Probably the only item I'm actually going to grab in this thing. I know there's an enemy over here. I can't see. That's another reason why I'm using the Magnum. Pretty much every enemy can do that. Like, the mines have a very high likelihood of creating those guys. Yeah, you don't even have to shoot them in the head, and they'll, they'll pretty much always turn into them. I think I can see the snake in that one. You can always... There's always a snake in one of those boxes. There is an emblem to our right as we enter here, but there's also enemies. Whoops. I cannot hit it. <laughs> there's also a gem right there. I'm, I'm missing a lot, though, even if I'm using a uh, one-shot weapon. Right, that's where they come from. They drop down.
I'm gonna go ahead and give this to her. I'm also gonna give this to her as well, because I'd like to have some room. Some enemies will never turn into them. But other enemies are pretty likely. Oh, she's gonna be an idiot and do that, but quite honestly, it's a pretty good idea to face it that way because you can actually see more. Uh, I'll go ahead and turn it because I don't want to just shove her. Alright, well, who's a, uh, I was wondering when the cutscene would start playing. Pretty good spot to use a nice little shotgun. Half, uh, more than half the enemies are actually just kind of dropped down here. Just barely missed getting hit by that guy. Wow, two of them. Yeah, there'd be like three guys eventually that would like drop down from the mines you just came from. Didn't shoot fast enough. I dodged the uh There's a lot of enemies right now. I managed to dodge the uh, the grab somehow, but I got hit by the unexpected ball. Oops, missed. I just saw a Molotov. Or dynamite, actually. I don't actually know what these guys placed. So. <laughs> All I know is that I'm missing one of them. I feel like Shepard's gonna get him though. Shepard. <laughs> uh, Shepard's really funny sometimes. I'm fine, I have full health. I thought there was an item in there. However, I can hear one of the... Hopefully I don't get shot if I shoot him. Yeah, uh, Honestly, Resident Evil is probably one of my favorite game series. It's really fun to play. I I li quite like 5 a lot. As you can tell, I'm by I'm playing it. People would like to crap on it, but it, it's really fun. It's... It's definitely one of my more favorite games of the series. I will admit there were some, thing some bad things about it, but... I mean, quite honestly... Prized game of Ford wasn't all it was to pack up to be either. Because to be frank, it had I mean it had tank controls. Got shot through that.
I didn't even think that was possible. Anyway, we have a good old elevator for some reason activates the uh, GPS even though the map I should say even though you don't really need it right now <laughs> there's an herb down here I'm going to take it because quite honestly a little bit low on health take this. god I hate you Sheva who AI <laughs> you take this I don't want it. I I really don't want it, Shovel. Located Irving, but he got away. Do you know where he went? I think he's heading to the marshlands. Okay, I'm sending someone after him now. I need you to head back to him. Can't hit the enemy. I better get ready. I don't actually want Shiva to stop doing that, but I know there's gonna be down here. Though frankly, I recall them standing up. I thought. Actually, know what this says. Uh, possible mutation body, low probability, but evidence is compelling. As for Sailor's point, weak against bright light. Address problem immediately. Huh. I didn't realize I actually talked about that. I mean, I've always known about the... About the uh, flash grenade being probably one of the biggest weaknesses. There's an emblem over here above this building. It's it's a really obscure one, honestly. Plus there's a chest with a uh, brilliant diamond. And an over here. Whatever. I did not think I could see this yet. I guess I have to get on top of that. Uh, on top of uh, this little hill. There's a porta potty zombie in here. Um, I can see it from here, you can see it right now. It's probably one of the more obs obscure ones in this game. Usually they're pretty obvious, you can just kind of like look around and probably find it. Is there a margin climbing this? Yeah, there he is. Oh, he died. Doo -doo -doo -doo. As soon as you come down here, hit checkpoint, but. Uh, there was no end. There was none. Pretty sure there's supposed to be a uh, thing out there. Remember, as soon as you come down here, though, there will be a uh, cutscene. Yeah, there it is. Here's an item. Went to the wrong spot. It's also that. This is why it's pretty good to have a uh, sniper in this mission. Missed that guy, unfortunately.
Anyway, snipers are really good in this game. Like... Oops, he's gonna die. Oops. You pretty much just want to kill a few guys so you can get up here. I would advise not putting AI Shiva up there. She's pretty stupid, gonna be honest. Like, 100%, she will probably die while being up there. So I did not recommend sending you up here. I did not want that. I want this. You need to be careful. Thanks for the help. I, huh. I have full health, yet she still ran towards me. I managed to not take damage from that arrow, and she was gonna get hurt. Guess not. These guys spawn infinitely, so it's mainly a good idea to just down, down the main guys. They're like, obviously in your way. Because as soon as you push this, they'll actually stop spawning. Oops. I cannot see my, uh, thing. At this point, we're just going to run, because I have taken too much damage. And we drop down here. Come on. It's safe. As soon as both, uh... Both partners drop down, he will spawn in. Yeah, you can actually shoot it out of the air, but it's kind of difficult. It doesn't take much to kill this thing. Especially when I just did, uh, like... 15,000 damage. Probably you could just shoot it in its chitin hide and still kill it pretty easily. Anyway... That's 2-2. Two, two. We still haven't dealt with guns yet, so it's pretty safe to stick with the melee vest. Ugh. After this one, I will probably go ahead and stop for the day. I might continue this thing later, but for now, this is all I'm doing. Likely. So I'll go ahead and just eradicate, uh... I heard about Irving. This mission where you have a yes, forced cutscene, unfortunately. Opportunities. Shove it to headquarters. This is headquarters. What's your situation? There's a high probability that Irving is on his way to an oil field. Didn't have anyone show up this stream, but you know. Rejoining Delta team and heading them now. Understood. Yeah, always a week is always a good way to start it. Uh, we've got company. They don't let up, do they? I thought about doing like a uh, hit fire only gun. Run. But like, oh, it's okay. it's nice. Not even fighting hard enemies yet. This is Captain Stone, Delta Team. I just received word from HQ. Based on the data you uploaded from that hard drive, most of the Tons people have been infected by parasites known as Las Plagas. What does all this have to do with Uroboros? You got me. They didn't see him. Looks like the only way we're getting answers is from Irving. Dude, I've actually died by a Molotov before. Like, if you don't be careful, some enemies will literally just spam a whole bunch of Molotovs. And you can actually get stunned from it, and it sucks. It's gonna get popping! Hang on! 
Like, I've done, I've uh, tried doing this on like professional before, and sometimes you have to be really careful. It really sucks. These guys can just like really shoot you. Like shoot you at the top right. Yeah, I see that. We just got stunned for a moment right there. And we got hit by another Molotov. I think we got shot after the fact. Immediately after you get off this bridge, there'll be a truck waiting to push you off. I've never actually died by that enemy. There are some uh, mo motorcycle guys here, but a good amount of the time you actually outrun them. Like if, for example, you like deal with them, but yet you kind of just get to run away. And suddenly you have full health. Yeah, you want to check out the, uh, the crossbow guys, because they actually do make this a lot harder than it needs to be. Look, there's something coming out of it. We should try aiming at those. Oh yeah, Shepard will give you that idea. Previous game or something? That is unfortunate timing for the lot the applauder to come out. Because now I have to focus on the applauder instead. Yeah, you really want to take care of those uh, other guys though, because they do do with some pretty good damage. Just trying to get the other guy, but I have to break this barrel. Didn't get it. I can't actually hit this Molotov guy, unfortunately. Okay. 
That's kind of weird how I didn't make him stun. He's going back over there. Hey, we're getting really unlucky. I don't know why we can't break those. Normally I do a lot better on this. I don't I don't know why he's not stunning. This is very weird. Well, it took two cycles though, meaning Chevy was able to keep a good aim. And this is only normal for the answer. I don't know why he took so long to stun. Normally he stuns almost automatically. Like, it usually does not take, like, anything to stun him. In any case, that will be all this time. Please subscribe, like, and follow if you enjoyed. And if you want more of this, do the same. Have a nice day.